Karen with Yes Please Paper Crafts. And in this video, I'm going to be sharing some things that I purchased from Creative Memories. And Creative Memories has a couple of really awesome promotions available. And I wanted to share that with you first. And then once I do that, I'm going to go through and show you everything that I picked up. I, I did get a few punches and some of the things from my new collection that they just put out and also a storage item, which I'm super excited about because this has been backordered and not available almost from the time it came out. <laughs> so I was really excited when I went to place this order and I was able to pick one of these uh, storage totes up. Okay, so let's go ahead and talk about the promotions first. And I have printed this out so that I can kind of share it with you. I didn't think I would remember everything that was included and I just wanna make sure that I get this information correct. Okay, so this first promotion is for the custom foiled spines for your Creative Memories albums. And you can replace the uh, spine of your album with a custom one that has uh, words on it so that you can see here in some of these examples, uh, they have like this one says the Jordan Family 2015. So you can write whatever you want on there. It's completely customizable. I think that's really cool. and. Uh, so you can get uh, one of these free if you purchase three. And this is uh, going on from June 22nd through July the 10th. So um, this you have to put the coupon code in if you decide you wanna use this promotion. And the coupon code is SPINEUS. And uh, one thing I wanna mention though is if you decide that you want to uh, do this promotion, you can't do the free punch promotion at the same time in the same order, but you can purchase separate orders and use the different promotions. So the second promotion that I have here is an exclusive punch. If you spend $125, you get to choose one of these exclusive punches while supplies last. And uh, this uh, goes from the June 22nd through the 30th. And so you still have a few days, once I post this video, um, you should still have a few days if you would like to, uh, to use this promotion. And the way this one works is if you put $125 or more into your cart in the Creative Memories website, you can click on the uh, view the cart. And when you do that, it will pop up a little um, box that says pick your punch and then you pick whichever punch you would want and add it to the cart and then that will be free and so um, I did go ahead and order this right on June 22nd and I was completely surprised because within four hours of me putting in my order Creative Memory sent me an email saying that my order had shipped and so I was able to get my order very quickly so I'm able to share it with you guys so that was super exciting. Now, you know, I did pick the grass punch. I just think that's the most adorable punch and I don't have anything like that uh, in my current punches. And so I was really excited to get that one. And I'm gonna share it with you guys and we're going to uh, punch something out with it. I wanna try it out. And so I will do that when I'm uh, sharing with you what I purchased. So you could also get this sun punch, which is cute as well. Now, if you want both punches, all you have to do is place two orders. Each order has to total at least $125. So if you want both punches, you would put in an order twice and you could pick the different punches. Okay, so the last thing that I have here is the new items. This is what's new from Creative Memories and uh, this is a new collection that they have, and I did get a few things from this collection, but it's called the Vitamin C Collection, and it's really, really pretty. It's kind of a tropical uh, beach uh, themed, and they also have a couple of new punches available. There's a seashell border punch, and also this kissing fish border maker cartridge, and uh, just really some cute stuff coming out from Creative Memories. Here's some additional uh, pictures of that uh, vitamin C. <laughs> I just think it's really, really pretty. Now, some of this is already out of stock. It's so popular, but it's going to, they're gonna get more of it in. So hopefully they'll get some more in. But um, I, I was able to get the stickers, the vitamin C paper pack, and also the map pack. And so I'll share that with you um, when we go through the different items there. Okay, so that's the promotions. So if y'all would like to shop with me, I will put a link in the description below 
to my Creative Memories site. And uh, you can also just search for me when you go to Creative Memories by putting in my name, which is Karen Yeagle. And I will put the spelling of my name up here so y'all know how to find me. Okay, so let's go ahead and look at the different things that, that I picked up here. This first thing is called the Medallion Decorative Punch. And uh, I've been eyeing this one for a while. It's been in my wish list <laughs> on the site. And uh, because I wanted to place an order to get that grassland border punch, um, I went through my wish list and picked out some things. And so this was one of the things I decided to get. And I thought this was really pretty. It's, uh, it creates a circular design. It's a medallion. It's a little bit uh, different. I don't really have anything like this in my punches. And I thought it would be a good one to have. So let's go ahead and just try this out and see what it does. I just love Creative Memories punches just because they're so super easy to punch out. But isn't that pretty? I just love that. That's going to be uh, something fun to be able to play with on layouts. And I did see a couple of different layouts where people use this and they created a border, just punched out a whole bunch of them and laid it across the bottom of a page. And I thought that was just really pretty. Okay, so we have that punch. I'm gonna put that over here. Okay, up next is the spring leaf chain. And this one just went into the last chance. And the last chance at Creative Memories is the place that uh, things go on the website when they're about to be discontinued. So if you want this one, you probably want to pick it up soon before it sells out because they won't be getting any more of this one in. And uh, this is really cute. It's a, um, this is, creates a lace. It's not a border punch. It's actually a lace. Uh, because when you punch this out, it separates and it just creates uh, a border strip and it doesn't stay attached to your paper. So I call that the lace uh, instead of a border. And um, I don't have my border maker system here with me right now, but if you want to see how this punches out, I will, at the very end of this video, I'll go grab that border maker system and I'll show you uh, what this uh, looks like when it gets punched out. Okay, so I got that one. All right, so let's take a look at the this one here. Now this is exclusive to the promotion, so if you want to get this one, you're going to need to purchase it within the next couple of days because um, it's not going to be available on their website. It's a special you know, promotion only um, thing. And you get it free if you place a $125 order. Okay. All right, so I also wanted to, to tell everybody, I, I almost forgot to mention this, um, if you would, if you're going to place an order, if you place an order with me and you uh, place the order and it's at least $125, which means you get the free punch, I will give you free shipping. And so how that will work is that once you place the order and it gets shipped out, I will refund you the shipping cost. Okay, so that's a special deal for anybody that watches this video. <laughs> okay, so I also wanted to mention that uh, the free shipping is uh, going to be available until July the 10th. And this is only for coming from me. This is not a Creative Memories offer. And so um, you will need to place the order with me. Once the order is paid for and it's shipped out, I will contact you and refund you the cost of shipping. The cost of shipping on an order of $125 is $8.95. Okay, so that's just my little way of uh, giving back to you guys. <laughs> Hopefully, uh, y'all will be able to uh, have the opportunity to pick up this punch because it's super awesome. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, show y'all how this punches out. And I have these little line, lines right here. It's like where the design starts. And so I'm going to just line the punch up with that uh, line so I can get it started. And then you're just going to move it over to the next one here. And we're going to just keep going over here and matching the design up. And I just think this is just super cool. I love the Creative Memories punches. They're just so easy to punch. And I do have problems with my hands. I have had carpal tunnel surgery on both of my hands and I have, I don't have very good strength. 
and I really struggle with using punches from other companies, but I have to tell you that the Creative Memories punches are the best of any punches I've ever used. They cut like butter, and I just think that is just so pretty. So that's what the, the uh, grass punch looks like. And so if you want this, you need to go place an order soon. <laughs> I also wanted to mention that if you have any questions about placing an order, you can either um, put a comment on this video or send me an email and I'll have my email address in the description of this video. Okay, so the next thing that I got here is this uh, vitamin C designer paper pack. And this is really pretty. I just love the paper from Creative Memories. Now the paper is much thinner than most other manufacturers. Uh, but it is a very good high quality paper that is double sided and it has a very nice texture. Well, not a texture. It's a very smooth finish. And uh, this paper right here, which kind of tells you like what's all in this uh, paper pack is actually a cardstock weight paper and you can use it as a white cardstock, uh, maybe for a background for your layout. So that comes with each of the designer paper packs. And so it kind of shows you what's on here, but you can always use this paper uh, to map photos or to use as a background. So there's 12 papers in this pack, two of each design. And so on this one, there's a sand, kind of like a beach on one side. And then the other side is a bamboo. That is so pretty. And let's see, the next one we have here is a, it's kind of like a beige color and it's got like kind of I don't know what you call that's like little flowers I guess and then on this side are seashells really pretty okay up next is this paper here which has these tropical leaves that's really pretty too and then on the back is this green tone on tone pattern and I really love that Creative Memories not only gives you patterns like this that are kind of more busy and have a lot of detail, but they also give you patterns that are more subtle that, um, you know, kind of coordinate. So I think that's really awesome. Okay, this next paper is, uh, is this one here. Um, this almost looks like uh, little uh, plants in different colors in like a turquoise, an aqua, and greens. That's super pretty. And then on this side is more leaves and flowers. It's got a very tropical feel. I think this would be perfect for beach photos or like if you went to Hawaii, which I've never gone to Hawaii, but I would love to go there. Okay, then we have this tone on tone stripe. And then um, the next one here is a darker like maybe blue and another lighter blue tone on tone we have this one that looks like the water that's really cool that'd be fun for a pool layout and then the last paper is this one which kind of looks like the ocean so really really cool paper i'm just going to leave that there because i'm going to go ahead and open up this pack of uh this is like a map pack okay so um what this includes is 12 uh, four by six double-sided mats or papers and then 12 four and a half by six and a half and what's really awesome is that you can use these to match your photos so here are the ones that are four and a half by six and a half and you can see each one of these is double-sided and some really cool designs that coordinate with the paper and uh, you can use all of these to map photos or you can use them to map the smaller cards that come with this uh, set. Here's one that looks like water. And then on the back of that is this one. And then this one, you could actually cut it in half and use and have two smaller cards, which is cool. Here's another one that's that looks like water that's lighter. And then here's one that you could cut apart. Here's one that looks like bamboo, and on this side is that journaling card with the green. Really, really pretty. I think this uh, particular collection is very sophisticated looking. It's very tropical, and uh, I just love it. It's going to be awesome to use for uh, some pictures that I have where I went on a cruise. That's what I'm planning to use it for. And uh, it's got a really cool tropical feel to it. So I was editing this video and I realized that I had completely forgotten to share with you the uh, little 4x6 cards that came in the mat pack. 
And so I'm going to go ahead and insert a video clip here to share this with you because I think they're super cool. And I wanted you to see the rest of what was in that uh, pack of uh, cards. So uh, they have these uh, quotes. This one says, make your own sunshine. And then on the back side is the same quote, but it's just going in the different direction. And I really love that uh, Creative Memories does that because whether or not your layout, uh, if, you, if you need to have something that goes this way, which is uh, horizontal, then you can use this side. But if you need something to go vertical, you could use uh, the other side. So I think that's really cool. So we have this one, which has these palm trees on one side, and then the other side has, uh, has it going the other way. And then this is really cute. It says, let the sea set you free. And there's a little fish. And then on the back is the same saying, a loving life. Really cute cards. This is my happy place. <laughs> I like that one too. And then we have beach days are the best days. I, I can't seem to turn it over in the going in the right way. <laughs> okay, and then we have this one, which doesn't have words. It's just a journaling card. And these are really nice to do your journaling. And uh, on that side is that one. And then we have this one, which is this really pretty kind of pinky tan color. And then the navy blue on that side. Here's one with some green and some tropical leaves. And then there's pink on that side. Some more with the leaves. I love this color green. That's such a gorgeous color of green. Uh, then we have this one. That's really cool. It looks like water, like waves, but it's like the, uh, the lines that you can do your journaling on. I think that's really cute. And then some more leaves on the back of that one. And then we have this one has another big journaling spot, or you could even do a title on uh, these cards. That'd be kind of cool. And then this one with the stripe pattern. So those are really cool. And I also wanted to mention that um, you can use these uh, journaling cards as they are, but you could also mat them on the larger cards. So just kind of so that you can get an idea of how that would look. I'm just going to take maybe this one. So you can see that uh, they fit perfectly. So this is the same size as a 4x6 photo. So you can either uh, use these to mat your 4x6 photos or you can also use them to mat the smaller cards. So I think that's really cool. Uh, and I uh, just love uh, how, that, how you can uh, kind of coordinate this and just uh, you know, use all kinds of different ones to make, uh, to make different mats. So super cool. I love these mat stacks and that's one of my favorite things that Creative Memories offers. I think it's really uh, a cool idea to have not only four by six cards, but also to have the four and a half by six and a half mats. Okay, so I'm going to go back to uh, showing y'all, I think, the stickers next. Now the last thing that I got from that collection are these stickers. This is three sticker sheets. It's also part of the Vitamin C's collection. And uh, I just love the little fish on here. These are cardstock weight stickers. And they're super pretty. There's like a little sun and some flowers. A tree, a wave, a couple waves. And some uh, fish and seashells. So that's that one sticker. And then the next one has a bunch of different... Uh, words and sayings on there and uh, I love this live in the moment and I love this view building beach memories really really cute stickers and then the last one of course is going to be the border strips this is my favorite thing I love that creative memories includes border strips with I think just about all of their sticker packs and this one with the uh, little surfboards isn't that adorable I just think that's so cute that's going to be fun to put on the on a layout as a border strip. And then there's also the one with the little bubbles. Okay, so um, that's all that I got from this collection. There's other things available. Um, I think there was a few things that were sold out. And so um, I was hoping to pick up the, uh, there's uh, 
the laser etched border strips. I was hoping to pick that up because those are really cool. They also had some um, embellishments and different things that go. And there's also an album. So there's, there's a lot of different stuff that goes with this collection. And uh, I just think it's one of the prettiest collections that they have uh, put out recently from Creative Memories. Okay, I'm just going to set that over here. And let's take a look at the last two things that I have here. Uh, these are both organizational items. This first one is called the Power Project Folder. And you get four in the pack. And if you have ever watched Craft Some Joy with Lauren Hines, uh, she has shared in her several of her videos how she organizes her paper collections. And uh, she uses these. And so uh, I decided uh, to get a few to try them out. I have a lot of different ways that I store paper. And uh, so one of the things that I was thinking about using these for was to store my Creative Memories collections because I'll be able to put all of this together in one of these um, power project folders. And what I loved about it was it's a very sturdy plastic folder and it has all these different pockets. So it has uh, two pockets here on the front that would fit the, these uh, cards. So you can put these matte stack cards in here. Okay, and then it has a pocket up here at the top that kind of goes this way. And I believe you can put the stickers in there. Let's see. I think they'll fit. Yep, so you can put your stickers up here. Okay, and then you can put all of this paper in the middle. Um, there's a big pocket back here in the back, and you can just put all of the paper there in the middle of, the, of this uh, project folder. And then on the back here, you have more pockets. There's two larger pockets that you can use. You could put the stickers, or if you have the the border embellishment that they have that are kind of tall and skinny would fit back here. You could put some of your paper scraps back here as you use paper from your um, from this collection kit. And so the other thing that I think is really awesome is they give you these labels. And so you could uh, write the name of the collection up here and you just put it up here in this little place where you can label all of these uh, project folders. These do also fit in the Calyx. And so you can just go ahead and just slide them right into your Calyx and you'll have this label here that tells you uh, what collection this is. And so um, I did get uh, one pack of these and I'm thinking I might get, I, I was trying to figure out if I uh, really wanted them. And after seeing it, I think I'm going to get another pack. So I'll have like eight of these. I also have some other things that I use to kind of keep papers together. And I'm going to do a video at some point and kind of share with you the different ways that you can um, kind of organize your paper. And I have things from Totally Tiffany. I have some stuff from Hobby Lobby. Uh, of course, I have this one from Creative Memories. And just kind of share with you all the different options of different things that you can use to kind of group your collections together. And so I'm going to be doing a video on my channel probably within the next month to kind of share that with you guys. So y'all be on the lookout for that. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet and you would like to see uh, more videos, I do organizational videos as well as scrapbooking and then also creative memories and other haul videos like Tuesday mornings. And if you want to see more videos, please be sure to subscribe. I would love to have you join my channel. Okay, so the last thing that I wanna share with you is this uh, storage case that I picked up. So this storage case has been out of stock. Every time I try to place an order, it would say coming soon, you know, next month or whatever. <laughs> they would get more in and before I could place an order, it was gone again. <laughs> so when I went to place the order uh, to get the grassland punch, I was so excited to be able to add this to my cart <laughs> and get it uh, in this order. Okay. And the reason why I purchased this is because um, I wanted it to use to go on crops. And I'm really hoping that that's going to, um, we're going to be able to get back to doing that soon. And uh, there's supposed to be one coming up in my area in September. And I'm hoping by September that we're going to all be able to get together again and do the crops. 
So I actually did purchase this kind of as a traveling bag, but I'm also going to be using it in my craft room for organization projects. I, I'm kind of put it together and then I'll kind of talk a little bit about what my plans are for this bag. So the thing that I really love about it is that it's customizable and you also have a place to put your paper trimmer. And that's one of the things I always struggle with when I go to crops or I go to someone's house. I never have a bag that fits my paper trimmer because it's just a, a weird shape. You know, it's really long. And so this particular bag is going to work for that. And so how this works is that you take this piece, I think is, I might need to look at the instructions. Hold on just a second. Let me go see how you put it together. <laughs> Okay, so uh, I just want to share a little bit of information about this particular uh, storage tote. It's called the Tools Organizer, and uh, it's 16 and a half inches long by nine and a half inches wide this way, and it's four and a half inches deep. And uh, this is kind of what it looks like when you have it put together and you have things in it. So you can fit things like the punches, your border maker system, and also your paper trimmer fits on top. Okay, so um, I just wanted you to know what that was and what it was called. So this does go down at the bottom to kind of add some support. And then all of these pieces have Velcro and you just need to put this together and I love that it's completely customizable you can uh, make the different compartments the size that you need, which is really awesome. But this piece goes in here. I think I'll put it this way. And then you have these pieces here that will go like this. And super easy that you, there's a bigger one and a smaller one. So you have a couple of different sizes of dividers. This one's a little bit narrower here and then there's a bigger one. But yeah, so you just put it together like that. You, you don't have to put all the dividers in there. You can put as many as you want. Um, you can also put things like your uh, templates or your cutting system in here. And if you want to carry some punches with you, you can put those in as well. And you just need to make sure you, you put uh, these dividers in the right way so that you have the space that you need to put all your different tools. Okay, so I'm just going to do that and I'm going to show you. It does fit the paper trimmer. This is the Creative Memories 12-inch uh, paper trimmer. And you can put that in just like this in the top and then just zipper it up and then you're ready to go and you can take this with you uh, to your crops. It's got a handle here on this side right here where you can carry it. And so it's really awesome. I think this would be really neat uh, to be able to pack up my punches and my paper trimmer and any tools that don't fit in uh, my other bag that I could usually carry with me. And so that's why I got it. Now, the other thing that I'm thinking about using this for when I'm not using it for the crop is to kind of put together uh, organization projects. And so I would put in here the things that I need to work on an organization project. And then I can carry it around my house to wherever I want to sit. So a lot of times I will go in my bedroom and work on projects or I will go in my living room and sit in the recliner. And so this is be really cool to be able to just load it up with whatever I'm working on, whether I want to organize some stamp sets or dies or punches or uh, whatever it is that I'm working on, whatever the project is, I could put all the different things that I want in here and bring it with me uh, around my house. So that's kind of what I'm going to be using this for. Now you could actually use it to store your punches and your border maker uh, system. And your, you know, you could use this in your craft room as a permanent storage, but my plans are to just use this kind of for projects and also to take with me to crops or if I'm going to a friend's house to do some scrapbooking. Okay, so the last thing that I wanted to show y'all before I end this video was uh, punching out the border maker cartridge that I got, which is called the Spring Leaf. So let me do that real quick so that y'all can uh, see how that punches out. 
Okay, so I have the border maker system here, and then I'm going to just go ahead and cut the edge of this paper off. So we'll have a straight edge to work with here. All right, and I can add this to a layout. That's so cute. Okay, so we're going to take this. Uh, this is a guide that you use. You flip this tray from underneath like this, and we're going to just lift up the uh, paper guide there and push it till it's flush with the tray. And then we're gonna just push that down. It's magnetic, so it holds on to the paper. You're just gonna flip this down. And we can take our cartridge, and you're gonna line these two pegs up. There's a little uh, dash line right here, and that lines up to each one of these areas. So we're just gonna line that up and just punch it go to the next one and we'll just keep going all the way down and I just love this border maker cartridge system it makes it so easy to make borders and this makes a piece of lace and I think that is just beautiful and uh, I just love that design Okay, so that's all I have for this video, and if you do want to get one of these punches that are included with the punch promo, be sure to place your order before noon on uh, June the 30th, and that is uh, Central Standard Time. So uh, if you have any questions, leave me a comment or send me an email, and uh, thanks so much for watching, and I uh, hope you all have an awesome day, and I'll see you next time. Bye now.